Hello everyone, my name is Shane Hopkins from MoneymakerSpy.com and welcome to Subscribe, a class about mastering the art of email list building and guerrilla email marketing tactics. I will be your uh, teacher for this course here on Udemy and this first video simply goes over the contents of the course and what you will learn as well as what expectations you should have coming in. Uh, the table of contents for the course is pretty much as follows. Uh, it's a 12 part course split up into about hour long segments. So it's about 12 hours of material. Um, that's not including projects that we will do offline which will probably consist of about another 12 hours. So about 24 hours of class time altogether. Um, what you can expect to get out of this class is you will learn pretty much how to master the art of building email lists for marketing um, campaigns and the engagement of audiences for any business, whether it's online, offline, brick and mortar business. Um, this works for any situation. You can also expect to learn how to uh, execute particular tips, tricks, and tactical strategies for guerrilla email marketing in itself. and. Don't be intimidated by the word guerrilla. It's nothing illegal or, or horrible. It just simply means unconventional and utilizing methodologies that others probably are not using. We will get into autoresponders, email list host providers, capture forms, list segmentation, copywriting, calls to action, uh, psychology of consumers, um, it'll all be in here, it's a full package. This is much more than a list building course. When you are done and you will get a certificate of completion for this course, you will actually be um, a moneymakerspy.com certified email marketing expert you will get a certificate and be listed on our site um, as such. You will also receive uh, JavaScript code to post on your pages um, to let others know that you have completed the course. This is important because it affects, uh, it affects uh, how people perceive you and it allows you um, uh, to pursue a, a little bit higher of a price point for your services if you're going to be doing it uh, for others and also let your customers know that you invest in yourself uh, through further education. That said, uh, let's quickly go through the table of contents so you can get an idea of what's inside the course. <clears throat> 12 parts, 12 hours. Here's how it's broken up. Part one is why build email lists, and we'll go over all the reasons why you do it and what they can be utilized for. Part two is email marketing, uh, self-contained and supportive arm of business models, how you can apply it to any business model, why it's important, how much of it, uh, how much of the business depends on email marketing, and what role email marketing plays today in all types of business online and for offline businesses as well. Section number three is the art of fishing. Creating lakes, water, and your favorite fish. This talks about where to find audience members, where to set up capture forms, what's appropriate uh, for a landing page, calls to action. Um, this, uh, part number four, what's a list worth? We'll talk about the actual value of an email list, each customer, and what formulas you can use to calculate not only the value of each customer, but how much income you can expect to generate from each customer over time 
and if you're into selling lists or selling solo ads for your lists or uh, building lists uh, to lease or whatever, this will give you a, a great overview and make you an expert in the, evaluate, the valuation of email lists and their content. Section number five is building the framework. Simple models that are easy to scale, easy to duplicate, easy to separate. Um, no easier way to put it in that. The framework is everything. Once you have the proper framework in place, you will be able to duplicate and quickly uh, start marketing uh, towards any business, any niche for yourself, for clients, whatever. Email is the first and foremost action a person should take when deciding to pursue, even before deciding to pursue, an idea, business, or invention, or project. You should not build your website first. You should not uh, go get partners first. If you have an idea about a business or a project or an idea, you need to immediately, first thing, start building a funnel that captures email addresses so you can start engaging with people who are interested in that industry or that topic of interest. This is how you build anticipation for launches uh, of products, uh, for starting of businesses. Um, you don't want to wait until you're ready to launch to start building your audience. You want to start building your audience long before uh, the first bit of code goes into the website or the first bit of type goes into the business plan. You already want to start probing at that audience and right away start engaging them and asking them questions about their pain points and asking them questions about their preferences and their needs and uh, start establishing yourself with them as an authority figure. You want to early on create customer uh, loyalty by engaging them early on in the customer lifecycle process. So that's what that section is about. Uh, section number seven is crushing capture forms. Uh, technology, capabilities, uh, psychology, finding the tipping points, uh, really optimizing capture forms using A-B testing, uh, making sure that your forms are converting uh, the optimal amount of people who are seeing them. This is an art in itself, the copy on them, the color, how they display themselves. There's a fine line between a form that captures almost everyone who sees it and one that pisses everybody off. So we'll go over that. Section number eight uh, is auto responder domination. Auto responder domination teaches you uh, copywriting and the beauty of the follow-up series. The beauty of the automation of the follow-up series. Auto responders are simply a system that starts emailing new customers or leads as soon as they sign up to your list. And uh, that might be once a day or a few times a day. It might be once a week, once a month. This is the art of that and how to build relationships uh, through the autoresponder. One of the most beautiful things, uh, there's no better feeling than uh, when you go to bed at night knowing that you have some mails going out and in the morning there's going to be money in your PayPal account or in your bank account because that mail went out automatically. People listened to it, believed it, trusted it, and as a result of it went out and purchased something. That is uh, when you know that you have mastered this art <clears throat> and it is a very, very great feeling to have that happen, and it will motivate you to provide value to your customers and ensure that they continue uh, to trust you and uh, to purchase things from you. Section number nine is broadcasting excellence. Um, the surreal power of the send button and instant wealth generation. Aside from autoresponder series communications, we have broadcast messages. And what we use broadcast messages for is when you want to create a communication that's outside of the normal autoresponder series, a special offer comes up, you do a joint venture with somebody who has a product, or maybe an event has happened that causes you to have an idea where this is the perfect timing to send this out, you'll create a broadcast email message that goes out just one time. And we'll learn about... Um, 
capitalizing on events and timing and things that happen um, to optimize conversions at a specific time. So today you might not have any communication scheduled, a major news event happens, and you find a way to do some news jacking and relate to that news event, pick up on the inertia of it and use the power of that event's inertia to fuel your product campaign. Um, that's a lot of fun doing broadcasts. Section number 10 is called monetize and supersize. When, why, and how to make sales today, tomorrow, and forever. And uh, I think it's pretty uh, self-explanatory. Monetizing and supersizing or scaling is the bread and butter of all of this. You can do everything in this course perfectly, but if you miss this part, you're not going to make any money. So what can you monetize? When can you monetize? When is it proper to scale up? When is it proper to quit and scale back? Um, math comes into play here, and it often becomes a very simple equation of this is what I put into it. This is what I got out of it. That would tell me that if I put this much more into it, this is how much more I got out of it. And when you're very researched, A-B tested, prepared, you can calculate a lot of this down to pennies usually. You should know at night when you send an email out to 12,000 people for an offer of $97, pretty close to what kind of money is going to be sitting in your bank tomorrow. Section number 11 is expansion, diversity, and superiority. Investing in sales channels um, related and unrelated to your niche. So this has a lot to do with um, not having all of your eggs in one basket. Having your entire marketing campaign for all of your income dependent on Google organic search is just not smart. We have to diversify our efforts. We have to do our best to dominate in those channels. And we have to know when to expand and when to pull out. So that's a strategic section of uh, really a very advanced section on how to keep your strategy sound and knowing how to identify opportunities as well as uh, risks, predicting risk, identifying opportunities, um, very, very important. Section number 12 is called looking forward. And looking forward is basically predictions, trends today and trends we see coming, um, and really investing in tomorrow and investing uh, in a manner that accommodates what we think will happen tomorrow. So it will talk about a lot about mobile platforms and advertising through them, creating apps uh, for your customer and for yourself to assist you in your email list building and your email marketing. We'll talk about, of course, media buying, and we'll talk about SMS campaigns, text message campaigns. We'll also talk about television campaigns coming back because a lot of the platforms that you see, like these mobile ad platforms and Facebook ad platforms, those are all running on TV now. With things like Netflix and Roku, and uh, we have a lot of the online networks expanding to the television set. So now we're not only going to have the challenge of needing to show up on smaller screens, we're going to have the challenge of needing for our media to show up on giant screens. And I'm very, very excited about that. I'm also very excited about the SMS campaigns because it's a phenomenal way to market to people when you have keywords that you can uh, text out to people um, who are on your list. And it's no different than capturing email addresses. You just ask them for their email address and you ask them for their cell number and the permission to text them once a week or a month. And when you do, you say text from moneymakerspa.com, reply with the code free book, 
and get a free book or replied with a code for this and get a coupon for this store. Uh, it's, it's phenomenal stuff. You're going to love it. <clears throat> All kinds of ways to make tons of money. Email marketing, email list building is the one element you can concentrate on to ensure you'll have a great chance of dominating no matter what business you go into or what business you have. This is how money is made. I will also be very transparent with you, the students, as we go forward and showing you my efforts and what I do in real time and what I invest in them, how I invest in them, how I put the campaigns together, how much money I make or don't make, successes and failures all together. We'll have some great student projects that will be done and transparent for others to see. And we'll have a great community of the students who are encouraged to work together on the forums, share their experiences, help one another, and really figure out how to optimize the knowledge that we're uh, learning here. I really look to the students for feedback to make the course better and also to keep learning myself. Things change every day on the internet. I've been on for over 20 years and I don't claim to know it all. I claim to know a little bit about a lot of things and I'll be a master of a few of them. But every day that goes forward, those things change and I need to keep learning. So I can learn so much from all of you and together, a bunch of great minds together in a platform like this of email marketing, by the end of this course, myself and this group of all of you together should be an unstoppable force when it comes to email marketing and there should be nothing that we cannot accomplish. I'm very excited to have all of you here. I thank you very much for taking my course and entrusting in me to be your teacher. I guarantee you, you will find the course worth every penny you paid, if not more. If you are not satisfied with anything at all, have questions, concerns, or need changes, or saw something wrong, please contact me directly, either through uh, Udemy or right at shane at moneymakerspy.com. I will answer each and every email personally. Please share in the forums with others so they can learn. You may be able to answer questions for others. Helping other people is one of the greatest ways to progress in this industry, and I uh, very much uh, advocate that. Again, I want to thank all of you. I will see you over on uh, lesson number one, why build email lists. And I can't wait to get started. All right, folks, I'll see you soon.